To write a basic statement in SQL, we can use select and from, and it's going to select or query data from a database. So here's what the syntax looks like for select and from. We're going to say select and identify the columns or fields that we want or that we're interested in the database from the table in the database that we're referring to. So let's say as an example, we have a customer's table. It kind of looks like an Excel spreadsheet. And in that table, we have a customer ID, their name, their age, and their country. But maybe what we're only interested in right now, at least, is the name. That's what we want to read from the database. So if we want that, we're going to say select name, that's the column or field we want, from the customer's table. That's the table in the database. We could adjust this, though, if we want a couple of columns. If we want the name and the age, we'd write it this way, name, comma, age. Or if we wanted all of the fields, we could use select star, as it's called, to pull all the fields from a particular table. We could also, if we wanted to, use select distinct if we wanted to pull a unique list from a column. So remove the duplicates. In this case, we're saying select distinct country from the customer's table. And in the list that's returned, we're going to see United States and Brazil both listed once because we want a unique or a distinct list. Even though Brazil is listed twice, we only see it once. So we can use select and from in SQL to write a basic statement. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click the subscribe button. And if you're interested in a SQL cheat sheet, you can find one over at CodyBaldwin.com.